Hi everyone, my name is Christine Lewis. I'm a counseling psychologist at Rhodes University Counseling Center. And I want to talk to you about suicide and how to cope with your suicidal thoughts. Suicidal thoughts and behavior is a response to a state, a state of depression and despair. It's when somebody sits with overwhelming, overpowering and unbearable emotions that is really difficult to describe. The person doesn't want to end their life, but they want the suffering and pain to end. And the goal is therefore to end the pain. And to end the pain, one needs to reduce the isolation. Isolation is key. This is when you feel um, nobody understands you. Nobody would understand your pain. You feel embarrassed. You feel ashamed. You feel guilty. And there is no help out there. But I'm here to tell you that help is available. The first step to dealing with your suicidal thoughts is to reach out. Reach out to a professional. Um, help is available. Reach out to somebody that is trained, somebody that is objective, and somebody that can assist you by putting strategies in place to help you cope with your suicidal thoughts. Sometimes suicidal thoughts and behavior stems from untreated depression or undiagnosed depression. And there is help available. With the right treatment, you can get help. Treatment can include medical intervention. That's where you take medication to help and assist alleviate the feelings of depression and the feelings that comes with suicide. Sometimes there are, there's, a, there's a chemical imbalance and medication can assist with that. Sometimes you need medication so that you can be ready and to be available for therapy. So the second thing is psychotherapy. Psychotherapy can help with your suicidal thoughts. You can discuss this with um, a psychologist. You can plan interventions together to help you manage cope with your suicidal thoughts and behavior. Um, thirdly, the, um, the, there's a need for psychotherapy and um, medi medication, so a combination of both. Sometimes there's a need for you to be, um, placed, to be placed in a facility for long-term treatment to help you cope with the severe depression. Um, where again you speak to a trusted professional and to manage you to help you cope with your suicidal thoughts. Then the se after the after how after reaching out, the second thing that that can assist is a support system. You need to identify a support system for yourself. That is anyone within the community, a trusted member a trusted friend, a trusted family member, a trusted church uh, person. Even here on campus, you can reach out to a lecture, to a warden, anyone that can assist you when you feel overwhelmed, somebody that you can reach, that you can reach out to and talk to. Then there are also various support um, systems available across the country. That is support systems that are run through SEDAC, SEDAC is the South African Depression and Anxiety Group. Here you can learn how to cope with your suicidal thoughts. You will be um, sharing thoughts and ideas in a trusted space. You can learn from one another. You can learn from how somebody else is managing with their suicidal thoughts and behavior. Then you also need to know your triggers. You need to know your boundaries. And you also need to know when, um, when like the warning signs, signs and when you need help. When you are suicidal, you need to reach out. Um, there's a 24-hour helpline. Um, that is 0800-567-567. This is a toll-free helpline that is available 24-7. Um, any time of the day you can call this number when you're feeling overwhelmed. When you feel actively suicide, suicidal, you need to reach out. You need to call ER24 
they are trained medical practitioners that can help you they are trained to manage and deal with suicide they will assist you with a 72 hour observation they will will admit you to your local hospital that is settlers here in Grahamstown then um, the doctor will come and assist and then they can assist you with fa further um, interventions so help is available um, there's help available on campus. Um, you can call the counseling center during the weekdays, Monday to Fridays. You can email us, counselingcenter at ru.ac.za, one word. You can speak to one of the psychologists at the center. And we can assist you um, to help you deal and cope and manage with your suicidal thoughts. But help is available. There is somebody that can help with the right treatment, you can get the proper help that you need. Thank you everyone for listening.